Last month, the mayor proclaimed August was going to be Better Together Month here in Houston. And in doing so, he has brought us all together to do better and challenged us to do better. He emphasized, and he just did again, a need for us to get the positivity rate down to below 5%. Last week, when I reported the positivity rate had gone from its high of 25.9%, last week we were at 23.3%, which was not a very big drop. This week, it is down to 17.6%. So that's a considerable drop. So I think it proves that when we work together, we can do better. So Mayor's right with our Better Together slogan, it can become reality. And we need to keep moving in that direction because while we have moved, and this graph shows the purple line is the 14-day average. So that is a, uh, we calculate that to make sure that it doesn't have a lot of variability from day to day. That is a very solid number. And you can see that it, the purple line does dip down to the 17. You'll see that the bars are dropping down as well. And that's a little bit uh, misleading because that has to do with the volume of tests. So that has nothing to do with the positivity, right? That is the volume of tests. So what that indicates is something we also talked about last week, and that is there is lots of testing which is still available. People are not going getting tested as much, which has me concerned, but to focus on the positive, I want people to know that if you want to get tested, and you call our number at the health department, there is plenty of testing capacity and capability available. So if you were worried about there being long lines, that's not quite so much an issue anymore. We have plenty of ways to get you tested, and uh, we will do that uh, because, unfortunately, not everybody has taken advantage of it. So let's go ahead and take advantage of it. Now is the time. We're moving in the right direction. Let us not lose momentum.